Hello guys, in Python, sometimes you need to install modules and external packages. So right here I have a project and I have imported Pygame. And as you can see here, I'm getting this error that says no module named Pygame. Now let's see how we can install modules and packages in Python using command prompt. So type your Windows key and type cmd. And then you can easily install modules using pip. So if I type the command pip install, what is the module that I'm getting error here in? It's Pygame, right? So if I type Pygame, this module will be installed. But in your case, pip might not be installed. So I'll show you how to install pip if it is not installed. So if I hit enter, as you can see, Pygame installation is now starting and it is taking some time. But in your case, if you are getting error, pip is not found or pip is not recognized, we will see how to fix that error in just one minute. So as of now, I have installed Pygame and this error will be fixed. Okay, so as you can see, now this error is gone after it did some processing here. Now, if you are getting the error, pip is not recognized. So let's see how we can fix that. First, go to your browser and go to this URL. I'll have this in the description below. You can copy it from there. Now go down and right click on this that says download the script below get pip.py. Right click on this and click on save link as. And you can save this file anywhere you want, but we need to go to that directory after saving it. So I'll just save it in desktop. Click save. And once it is saved, go to your desktop or wherever you have that file. Now hold shift and right click. And these options will come. Here you need to click on open PowerShell window here or if you have open command prompt here, that will work too. I click on open PowerShell window here. And now just type Python and then type get dash pip. And you can hit tab to auto complete this and hit enter. Now this will install pip for you. So now you're getting this message successfully installed pip. So pip is now installed in your system. Now, after installing pip, we need to add pip to our environment variable. So let me show you where pip is installed first. So I already have pip installed. And so let me see where it is actually installed. And then I'll show it to you. Okay. So this is the path where pip is installed by default, right? If you are not shown where the path is installed, what you can do is go to your explorer and then go to C drive, go to your users and then go to your current user and then go to app data, go inside local and then inside where is programs and then inside Python and then inside your specific Python version and then inside scripts. This is a very long path. I also have this in the description below. You can copy it from there and just replace this part here, this part here with your username and you need to add this path. As you can see, there is pip here to your environment variable. So to do that, just press windows again and press environment variable, type environment variables hit enter, click on environment variables and in this path here, double click on this and at the bottom where there is an empty row, double click and paste that path here and then hit OK, hit OK, hit OK again and then you can close your command prompt and then open it again and pip will work for you. Let me know if you have any questions.